the Professional Horseman Small Business Workshop. What an excellent way to bring more education to the AQHA convention. How did you come up with this idea? Well, it was actually the council. It was uh, something that we've wanted to do. We want to you know, bring professionals to the convention because they have so much to offer to help drive the industry in a positive way. And we thought, what better way than try to help to educate them, give them something they can take back to make their businesses more profitable, give back to the horse, make their their training methods safer, just of all aspects. So we thought this was a really good way to launch it and uh, reach out and, and, and touch our pros. Christy Landwehr from Certified Horsemen Association that gave us some teaching tips plus an overview of the CHA. We had Yvonne Onkrent, equine lawyer. She did Equine Law 101. Absolutely fabulous. Really was very eye-opening and, and uh, gave a lot of insight into things that pros really need to be looking at to protect their businesses and their livelihoods. Then we, we uh, had Kimberly Brown. She talked about social media. I got so many great tips on social media, how to promote your business on social media. And then, of course, we finished up with Becky Peskin, and uh, she talked about how to make your business more profitable and, and gave us some really insightful tips. And, of course, you know, through all that, we had the support of Marielle, our corporate partner, and, and uh, they backed professional horsemen um, all the way and, and we just really realize and we really appreciate their support. I think education is so key at conventions like this and I think we can meet and we can have conversations about the betterment of the breed but to have some specific education about different topics is great as well. Um, it was really influential to me because Yvonne the lawyer came and spoke about the equine law and um, as a senior in high school going into college it's kind of been an idea that I've been bringing around like if I wanted to be a lawyer or not but I wasn't sure on like what I actually wanted to be. So um, bringing in like all the facts and stuff about the equine business um, really made me interested because it kind of gave me an idea of what I would be if I became a lawyer. We want this, uh, this event to grow. We want to be able to continue to give to our professionals and, and uh, you know make them be the best they can be and uh, support our, our industry and support our horse. The professional horsemen and the council really appreciate the support that they're getting from the executive committee and the association to help them make a difference in the industry and, um, you know, just be better at what they do.